YouTube, what's going on guys? My name is Gray. Today, we're gonna to be taking a look at the Ducky X Vermillo Beijing Opera 65% keyboard. My first thoughts when uh, picking this boy up was, uh, I was looking for a keyboard and I've been using the Creator Mecca ever since I made the review on it and it's done great for me. Um, but I definitely wanted to get my hands on something different. So I went over to Mechanical Keyboards and uh, found one I liked and shot my shot and asked for a review board and they came through. So Tracy from Mechanical Keyboards, thank you for providing the keyboard for the review. When I took it out of the box, is it's gorgeous. Um, it definitely takes a different approach to the traditional gaming, gaming keyboard. Um, it's, it's a piece of art. It's, it's very, very pleasing to the eye to look at. Um, they have a bunch of designs and the color scheme is fantastic. <clears throat> um, but one thing that I really liked a lot was the uh, aluminum backing. It's like, it's, like a, it's like a plastic aluminum, but this, this gold etching here is, it feels like a metal of some sort. Um, but it's gorgeous. It, they did a great job. The attention to detail is definitely there from the actual frame itself to the space bar to the entry key. Um, it, it looks great. It, it's a very, very aesthetically pleasing keyboard. For the switches, they went with the EC Sakuras uh, from Vermillo. These are great, great switches. I'll do a sound test for you guys so that you guys can know exactly what you're buying when you do buy it. So now for uh, something a little more practical, the form factor, 65%. Um, this is not my traditional go-to, but if you do like 65% keyboards, this is definitely one for you. Um, it's it feels it feels good. The size is nice. If you're somebody that likes having arrow keys in the bottom right-hand corner, uh, it's definitely for you. If you're not, then obviously get a 60%. But this is a review for a 65%. So get out of here if you want a 60%. <laughs> Anyways, guys, it uses the QWERTY, the normal, traditional uh, keyboard layout. So what you see on a normal board, you're going to see here. Uh, there is some different designs on the keycaps, which you may get lost in, but there are English lettering on the keycaps as well. This keyboard does not feature a mic port or uh, a USB port. Some keyboards do. I know Razer does a lot of the USB pass-through stuff. Um, but the Ducky X Vermillo does not. And one thing that kind of stood out to me was not very much RGB, at least with the keycaps on. If you were to switch the keycaps, then I'm sure um, the RGB would shine through, but it's very, very minimal. Um, there's no RGB, and I feel like they did that on purpose to um, provide all the attention to the art on the board itself. Because um, it's definitely something that doesn't need light to... Uh, so yeah, I've been using the keyboard for about two weeks now, and... Um, I have very few bad things to say. Um, the only one thing, the one thing that I just could not figure out, um, when you click the number keys on the keyboard on the top row, um, they are defaulted to F keys, so your function keys, so like F1, F2, F3. Um, I couldn't figure out a way to switch it and it didn't come out of the box like that, so I don't know. Um, it's very annoying, um, but it didn't bother me enough after a certain amount of time, so yeah, it's all good. But overall, the design is fantastic, the form factor is great, the keyboard and the switches sound phenomenal, and uh, I definitely recommend picking it up if you have the budget for it. The keyboard comes in at 135 US dollars, and if you want a sweet discount, make sure to use code GRAY at Mechanical Keyboards. Now guys, if you did enjoy this video, please click like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on the bell for notifications, and before you go, a word from our sponsor of today's video. Say goodbye to your greasy leather wallet. The Ridge has you covered. Coming in with over 30 different designs, the Ridge's goal is to provide you with a modern, sleek, classy feel rather than the traditional wallet. Their wallets feature RFID blocking technology and feel fantastic in your pocket. If you aren't satisfied, you'll get your money back. No ifs, ands, or buts. That's how confident the Ridge is that you'll love their product. 